Lucas here, Hey Jr. back in it again with another unboxing. Today's unboxing is for the Hunger Games 4 film collection on Blu-ray. This is a six disc set, Blu-ray disc set. Uh, it only contains Blu-ray and the digital HD. Uh, the collection includes over 14 hours of bonus features, includes 13 never, never before seen deleted scenes, and two previously unreleased features, and much, much more. So I'm um, definitely glad to scoop this up. I got this off of GoHastings.com. They had this pretty much at the lowest price uh, at the time. Um, this was this was actually a pre-order. Um, it was around forty dollars or so, and I was you know I was looking at Amazon and other sites, and it was you know in the fifty dollar range. So I uh, got this for a good deal. I kind of wish I held out because they had a twenty percent off sort of discount. Um, that's when it's released. Um, on GoHastings.com, so I kind of wish I kind of waited out. I could have, you know, gotten this a little cheaper, but I really wanted to scoop this up. I've been holding out, you know, for since the movie came out. I've been holding out um, for this, this sort of release because I wanted to grab them all at once. Um, so definitely glad I held out. Um, yeah, especially for these bonus features, well worth it. So let's crack her open. Let's get started. Got that to the plastic here. Open it up. Nice. I don't want to scratch it up. Just got this sucker. All right, there we go. And there you have it. Ooh. There we go. And look at this. Very nice, very nice. So we had the back cover here uh, it basically just states you know all the films um, little synopsis experience the epic adventure of Hunger Games series uh, from start to finish in his action-packed collector set follow Katniss uh, Everdeen's transformation from tribute to the girl on fire uh, to the symbol of symbolic leader Mockingjay including a thrilling collection of four movie lovers uh, basically the old treasure and um, basically just the disc uh, as far as the films, um, let's see, just the bonus features. And the six disc contains uh, just that big uh, 14 hours of uh, bonus features. But you also have bonus features on the, uh, the individual disc as well. Um, so uh, here's a list of sort of the bonus features, the 14 hours of bonus features that they have listed. So you get 12 never before seen deleted scenes from Hunger Games, six deleted scenes from Hunger Games, Hunger Games Catching Fire, including one never before seen, um, uh, nine, excuse me, nine deleted scenes from Mockingjay Part 1, and two all-new featurettes picturing Pan Am and the Capital Cuisine, uh, 70 additional features from the four films, audio commentaries, music videos, and much, much more, as well as the digital HD copy. Uh, for each movie. So, that's that. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And we have the bad boy right here. Pretty nice. Love that cover. Look, all white. Very cool. We got the mocking J symbol. Pretty cool. That is. Oh, look at the back. I love the back right here. Whoa. Look at that, people. Check that up close. Just her transformation from all the films. Pretty dope. All the characters. That is pretty cool. I wonder if they have a poster of all these, uh, these characters. Hmm. Pretty cool. And... Ooh. Flip her over, we got these discs. That one popped out. So, we have all the discs here from all the films. This one right here that just fell out. This is the one with the bonus features. So, pretty cool. Yep. And, let's see here. So each film has a picture of the characters' faces. Uh, the first film has Katniss, uh, the second film, Catching Fire, has Pita, 
and I forget the the Josh is it Josh Hutcherson. Uh, I forget his character's name, but he's on the uh, Mockingjay Part Two. So Mockingjay Part One has who's on that Mockingjay Part One is I forgot her character, but anyone if you could tell me who this is, I forgot her name. Uh, let me see. There we go. If anyone remembers her name, please shout out. All right, and you have the bonus features disc. And what is this? It's another one. Special features for Hunger Games. Oh, so they, uh, yeah, they have a, a second disc for the first Hunger Games movie. This just includes the bonus feature. This first one is just the film. So that's the bon These are the bonus features for the first film. So that's pretty cool. All right, guys. So definitely glad to pick up. Uh, once again, uh, I've, I've been holding out uh, because I've wanted to own these films so badly. Um, but I, I knew they were going to come out with a big box set. So definitely rule of thumb when it comes to a trilogy or or a series that starts coming out. Um, definitely, I don't know, it, it, depending on if you want to scoop them up right away or not, um, it can't hurt to hold out. Um, because uh, they they do some crazy stuff like this with these bonus features. But um, once again, I love these films. My favorite one would have to be Mockingjay Part 2. That was just... That, 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 that threw me back to those old 80s action films. Like, you know, Running Man. Though it felt like that. Like, it felt like that. It, it had that same kind of tone to it. But it wasn't too campy or too cheesy. Um... I would have actually liked to see. I mean, it was it was PG thirteen, right? So, uh, it was pretty. It was pretty. There were some moments there, like the um, I think there was a scene with these uh, sort of white zombies in Mark and J Part Two. Terrifying, <laughs> absolutely terrifying. Um, yeah, scenes like that made made it hard a little hard for me to believe that was uh, PG thirteen. I would actually like to see an unrated version, but you know. They wanted to keep them PG, PG-13, um, you know, these YA novels. They want to make them uh, accessible to everyone. So, um, But once again, I love these films. Uh, they, <laughs> When it comes to the YA novel sort of into film, these, these, these films are just a cut above the rest. Um, the Divergent series, eh. Um, just the characters, the acting, it's just, the, the, the money was definitely put into these films. And the care and the love of the novels were definitely put into these films. And they, they executed it very well. Um, I don't think anyone can top, you know, as far as these YA novels, I don't think anyone can, can get to this level. Um, Jennifer Lawrence, her career, I mean, she blew up mainly because of this film, so... Yeah, great films, great acting. Um, if you haven't seen the Hunger Games uh, films, definitely check them out. Like yesterday, because <laughs> um, it's 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 just it's a masterpiece. Yeah, I'll I'll say that. I'll say I know they're YA novels, but it's good. It's 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 just a good transition from a novel to a film done right. You know, some people some films, you know, they'll screw that up easily. Uh, just looking at those dollar signs, but they really took their time to 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 bring this to life, to to really do this, do the novel um, and just the 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 franchise itself justice. And I'm um, definitely glad I own. All right, guys. So uh, this is uh, Harry Jr. signing off again. Thank you guys for watching this unboxing. And uh, yeah, tell me what's your favorite uh, favorite Hunger Games film. I want to know. Um, definitely shoot in the comments. Uh, so yeah. All right. Check you guys later, man.